Hello and welcome back to Rare Roads Online. So today we are doing a little different video. It's going to be our first run, but we did do that um, multiplayer. But I figured I'd take a opportunity to show the new locomotive train setup that we're using. So we did throw a caboose on the uh, hopper car train. We uh, put C O M P on it instead of a number. And then did name that one the Radio Flyer. As you can see, the old smokestack's working. Looking good. It's just a good looking caboose. So uh, we stepped up the hopper cars from the uh, 48. And we decided to uh, pick up a Class 70. And put that on there just because this one's going to be running, obviously, coal out on the long runs. And stuff like that. So just for easy use lots of wood lots of water that kind of thing we did name this one Cornelius for Vanderbilt it's for the Commodore there and uh, put the uh, number 70 on that one just to uh, keep it simple right so there you go class 70 went with the blacked out paint scheme on this one and uh, Everything else on the insides are all pretty much the same. That same great green. So there's the new uh, locomotive. And uh, here, seeing how it did on its first run. Hope you enjoy the video. And Stop right here. Thank you. Perfect. <clears throat> How do you dig the look of this train? I like. Next one, please. Stop right here. Nice. Thank you. The caboose is pretty cool. Happy Next with the one, way please. that came out. I think it'll help with loading. Stop her here. Thank you. Makes the end of the train easier to see. Alright, we got wood, we got water. We got everything else, so we are good. Fully loaded. Nice. And we are rolling out. Sweet. And you can have the brake in the back. And we should be good. How much do you want me to set it to? Uh, I mean, I'd, I wouldn't... I would wait until, I guess, we get to the S's and around the S's. I'd probably just crank it. Who knows? We'll, we'll have to see what happens. I've never had a caboose, like, actually functioning doing anything. So, uh... The brakes are quite good, so... Yeah, that's, I mean, that was my impression just from, like, you know, I've slapped on the brakes when I've been driving it around and stuff before, so I'm thinking they're pretty good. So, you know, I'm thinking if you apply them as we go down through the S's and I hit the brakes, we should be pretty good. But let me brake first, because I don't want the cars to slam into right. you. Because it'll that way they'll stretch out. Yep. I like how the Class 70 rocks on that turn. It's like, give me a break. It is not like a rocking kind of turn. Yeah. I kind of want to start braking now. I mean, you know, if you feel like it. We do have a little bit. We have a little bit of an uphill right here, and then, and then we Break hit the S turn. All right. On my end, it looked a bit sketchy, so I wanted to break a little bit. Sorry. No, no worries. Coasting for the S turn. Okay, brakes. Brakes. 
60%. Yeah, I think we'll go nice and chill. This is our first run. No point in getting too crazy. Nope. It's all the brakes it's got. I'm got at 78% now. Yeah, I mean, okay. We came down nice though. Nice and yep, in control. Really Tinder brake is off. Full brakes off. Locomotive brake is off. We are running. Yeah, why not? That came out smooth. Nice and yep. easy. Alright. Well, we figured out how to smooth that run out. Yeah, but I didn't want to go full 100% in the S turn in case you're pulling too hard and then we still derail. Right. Yeah, no, I mean, I think, you know, with the brakes we managed, that one was pretty smooth. I mean, we didn't stop, we kept going. Yep. But all smooth. Probably gonna do a little bit of brake here. Go ahead and start spinning that on some. This is, this is the wild turn. It gets a little bit. 32%. Okay. There we go. 62. Nice. It does smooth out the train a lot. That back breaking. Yep. Just keeps things actually nice and controlled. That's cool. Trains actually spread out nice. Looking good. Ooh, we're definitely running at full speed. 100% now. Uh oh, I wonder which direction this turn is. Probably not in the direction we need it. Train is coming to a rest. Yeah, we gotta flip the switch. I don't know if you want to run up to the loco. I can yeah, get... I'm going to check the train if nothing derailed on that run. Okay. Switch is green. All seems good. It will release the back brake. Nice. Big old 70 is doing a job. Brake is off, you can go. Alright, we'll go rolling out. Ooh. Boy, it's rocking like crazy. They really like the class 70 just acts like the Heisler now. I wouldn't be surprised if he just took the physics engine from the Heisler and put it on the class 70 just because of how it rocks now. The class 70 never used to rock in the turns. I mean, that was the big advantage of the class 70 over the Heisler. And now it really seems to rock just like the Eisler. Alright, we can go a little faster than this. We are going to have a brake ink section coming up here for sure. Yep, I remember. <laughs> Nine percent. Locomotive is coasting. 29%. And applying some brakes. Cranking on the brakes. 49. I'm just going to crank on the brake because this is going to get dicey. Usually I throw on some tinder brake in here. Applying the tinder brake. 100% on the back. Okay. Yeah, at least that all brings it down nice and chill. 
So that's cool. Okay. So we can just spin down the brakes for sure, hitting this curve from now on. Yeah, but not straight away 100%, please. Right. Loco brakes are off. Twenty percent. Tinder brake is off. Applying some power. Fifty percent around the curve. Back brake eighteen percent. I mean, this locomotive is actually, like, legitly being brought down the mountain, though, without, like, all being sketchy or anything. <laughs> it's kind of legit. Brake 55%. Alright, throw in 40% brake up front. 100% brake on back. Alright. Bringing us down nice and chill. Alright, reducing to 20% brake in the loco. And taking the loco brakes off. Back brake 80%. Sixty-three percent. All right, going to twenty percent break up front. Eighty-five percent in back. All right. Hundred percent in back. Fifty percent, sixty percent up front. There we go, nice and smooth through the last turn. Breaks off up front. And applying just a touch of power to pull us up to the dock. Eighty-five percent in back. Nice run. Seventy percent in back. One car length to braking. Forty percent in back. Half a car. 22%. All stop. 100%. Nice. Alright, where are we at now? Who did we get that stopped in time? Let's go for it. Yep. It's paying. Nice. Rain too? Pay, 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 pay. Yep. It's raining money. Nice. Heck yeah. That's a pretty good one. Cannot complain. Alright, can we bump you forward? Break off. Breaks and Becker still at 100. Sweet. Money is piling in. Very good. Yeah, heck yeah. All right, there we are. A successful run. Got some uh, board delivered, and uh, I think we'll call that one a win. So we'll say thanks for tuning in. Remember, if you get a chance, like, share, subscribe. Subscriptions are free, but they sure do help the channel. Y'all have a great day.